So, as we are small YouTubers ourselves, when we watch YouTube, we tend to watch like the smaller YouTube channels because we like to support them and we also like that kind of support. But every now and again, we do like to watch some of the bigger YouTube channels. So what I thought I'd do today is run through a few of the bigger YouTube channels that I personally like to watch because Lauren watches some YouTube channels that I don't, I watch some that Lauren doesn't. So here's my list of things that I like to watch on YouTube. So first off, love Florida. And when you love Florida, the vlogger that he watches, the Tim Tracker. So like, we all, we've always watched the Tim Tracker. That's kind of why we got into vlogging in the first place. So we still keep up with Tim Tracker's vlogs. He's always good to watch, the Tim Tracker. So that's number one. Secondly, and keeping to that sort of Disney theme, there's also Rob Plays, who makes really interesting sort of um, Disney history videos information about Disney, about the parks, about its history and all that good stuff. Really interesting stuff. Go check it out if you've not already checked it out. Rob plays. Good stuff. Then we're going to move slightly outwards from Disney a little bit with Super Enthused. So Super Enthused does, yes she does a lot of Disney stuff, but she also does like other around um, Florida kind of adventure stuff. Uh, so it's not always theme parks, sometimes it's just exploring things, going places, that kind of stuff. So um, Super Enthused is another really good channel. Which leads me very nicely on to Adam the Woo, who is um, probably my favourite vlogging channel at the minute. Who uh, Adam the Woo goes around and he films just sort of random adventurous stuff, he'll go like explore what's down this street, what's in this abandoned building, what's here, what's there and just film stuff and it's interesting and it's fun and he still does Disney theme park stuff but he also does a lot of stuff that's not Disney too which is awesome, it's fun, it's really good, it's something different and he's funny, I like him. Now for something completely different, I love Star Wars and when I want my sort of daily Star Wars fix, I go to Star Wars Explained, which is like a daily Star Wars vlog channel. So every day I'll put up a video that's got something to do with Star Wars and the canon sort of law. So it might be something about the movies, it might be something about the books or the video games or a certain character or a spaceship or this or that. If you're a nerd and if you like Star Wars, Star Wars Explained is the one for you. If you're into comedy, if you want to laugh, which we often do, just to put something on before we come up to bed, we tend to put on something sort of funny. Um, we like to watch Cinema Sins, which they just go through all sorts of films and they pick them to bits, like nitty picky funny things that they'll just pull out and they'll give it a sin for. And they've got a little sin counter up in the corner I can't really explain it. Go watch Cinema Sins, it's really funny. And speaking of really funny, Red Letter Media. Red Letter Media is amazing. Um, I initially discovered them when they did uh, a big whole sort of Star Wars prequel trilogy breakdown sort of thing. But um, they are big film buffs and everything and they do best of the worst. Which is essentially the sit down with three old old B movies like really terrible B movies they watch them they react to them which is hilarious and then they decide which is the best of the worst B movies I hope that makes sense go watch one of the best of the worst videos because honestly they're so funny and Rich Evans's laugh is everything and then I'm gonna wrap it up with one more YouTube channel which is Adam Savage has tested. So I like building stuff, I like constructing stuff, I like the whole um, planning and processing and putting things together kind of thing. And Adam Savage has tested is awesome. Like he'll do one day builds, which is like he might want to do, I don't know, a prop gun from um, Guardians of the Galaxy or something, or he might make some sort of cosplay outfit. Or it might just be like a shelving rack with some nuts and bolts. 
but it's like you find yourself riveted, ha, riveted, riveted by just watching this guy put together things. Like, it sounds really boring, but Adam Savage is really funny. He was one of the hosts of uh, Mythbusters on the Discovery Channel. So, uh, pretty charismatic, it's funny. Go go watch Adam Savage's Tested. If you, want, if you like watching people build things and put things together and make things out of nothing, then Adam Savage has tested. Also, I wish I had a workshop like Adam Savage did because like he's got everything to hand, he's got every tool in the world and I could just like imagine sitting down and thinking what can I build today? I can build a mailbox from up and then he can have it done in like half an hour and it looks amazing. I want to be able to do that. So there you go, there are eight YouTube channels, bigger YouTube channels that I like to watch on a regular basis. There are others, but um, I don't watch them as regularly, if you know what I mean. And I still love the little YouTube channels. It's a whole like juggling act when you've got like loads of these little YouTube channel videos that you really want to watch. And then there's some of these big YouTube channels that have put out videos and you're like, I really want to watch those too. It's a whole juggling act. It's a fun juggling act and I love it, but yeah. And with that being said, I'm going to get gone. So I'll see you guys next time.